Hey there, welcome to my channel. This is Sage the Intuitive and I'm here to get some spiritual tea for the sign of Aries. So we're going to see what is going on for Aries from the spiritual point. So we may get some love messages. We may get other messages, um, what you may need to work on spiritually, but we're going to jump right in. Let's see, overall energy for Aries spiritual tea. What does Aries need to know? Past life soulmate, you have met, have had many lives together, so likely this is going to be about love for you, Aries. Yeah, but whatever it is, whoever this past person is, um, or you may have met them already in the 3D in your life right now. The thing is there you are on a time out or there is some type of distance between you and this person there is a possibility that you have not met them yet but um you and some soulmate right now are on some type of time out from each other could be because someone has not um had the courage to take action towards a new beginning that could change in the springtime. There could be some seeds planted that in the springtime this can make it, this could change here. But somebody has a decision to make. It looks like somebody has multiple options or multiple directions to decide which way to go. Could be you, could be them. Aries. Tell me more about Aries. You're needing to release and surrender things that are no longer serving you. You're holding on to some stuff that you need to purge and release. And uh, for some of you, and you're not even dealing with whatever these things are, <laughs> Aries, I just heard some of you think you're perfect already. <laughs> I promise you, I didn't say that. That literally so came to my head. Aries, some of you are thinking that um, you don't need to do anything extra. Um, yeah, but you are not in unity with yourself. So you're not um, fully aligned as of yet. There is still some time and some things that are happening for you. For many, for many of you, this is the feminine energy. So if you relate to the divine feminine or feminine energy and... Um, in in relationships or in your life you, do, you you associate with the feminine energy you're needing to align a little bit more you're needing to focus on some self-love and really try to do um, make some intentions for yourself you are a great creator but you um, are lacking something and that's why you are not completely aligned yet there is something here that is pulling you towards um, needing to set specific intentions around some gifts that you have or something that you know how to do really well but you're kind of um you're putting it along to the side right now and then for whatever reason these two are turned up on my car on my deck so i just want to let you know there could be a re reunion with someone who's um in regards to a twin soul or a soul tie you have someone with there's a reunion energy here um so just want to show you that because that was turned up in, on, on this side. But in any case, some of you need to make some specific intentions here um, or, or in regards to your gifts, what you need to be doing with your life. Um, so whatever that looks like for you. While you have this past life soulmate, maybe that's a twin energy. You're not going to get this twin energy and this reunion energy until you deal with whatever it is over here. The self-love and all of these things that you need to work on. Aries, please. More for Aries. Give me some advice for Aries, please. Some of you are needing to cleanse your home, maybe needing to sage your home using some Palo Santo. You're also needing to, um, you're being encouraged to get some black tourmaline for protection. This is going to help clear and ground your energy because you're in balance um, for many of you. So in order to um, help 
to bring balance back into your life. You're needing to um, do that. You have self-love once again. Some of you are not focusing on yourself as much as you should be. You're not also not listening to your spirit guides as they're trying to tell you what to do. You're imbalancing your root chakra. So that basically means that... Um, you could be you could be having issues when it comes to reproduction as well so if you're trying to have a, a child or conceive a child you could be having some issues there um here um those reproductive issues you could have some circulation issues as well but you're lacking some type of stability again because you are imbalanced here and so you're needing to ground yourself as well but really practicing um self-love is at the end of the day so self-love could be a vacation for some of you you're needing to take some type of vacation here as well but there's a change that needs to happen and people that you're getting involved with they're marrying whatever is happening um like whatever you're doing to yourself or doing to other people is being mirrored back to you through people um archangel michael is here to protect you and bring you guidance here you have some imbalance potentially with your throat chakra so archangel michael is here to protect you with, with the things that you could be um not saying and or um communicating well so if you're having issues with also with like any cold issues neck stiffness those type of issues um that could be because you're imbalanced in your throat chakra some of you may be experiencing as well the spiritual flu which i saw a couple times as i was shuffling here you're needing to trust the divine here um as well so let's see how long is it going to be for things to um elevate for aries let's try to see what we can find out for aries You're going to need to connect with some people that can help you get through these things right now. So in these, you're just needing to wait a little bit. You're needing to communicate clearly. We see that there are some blockages in your th throat chakra. So you're needing to commun communicate clearly, but you're going to run into some people that can help you. If you have people that are more spiritual, that can kind of help you elevate forward, help you to understand things that maybe you're not really fully understanding at this time, connect with those people. Those are the ones that will help you. So that is what I have for you, Aries. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and certainly leave me a comment. See you soon. Take care.